As the first rays of the sun made its appearance in the Saturday sky, so too did the Asantehene Otumfo Oseitu to the second of Ghana. The king and his retinue gathered at the south terminal of the Piago International Airport for his departure. Before his departure, the Asantehene was escorted by the chief of protocol to the dais to receive a salute from the quarter guard. The king was then escorted to the aircraft by the Minister of Foreign and Caricom Affairs, Dr. Amory Brown. During his visit, the Asantehene had courtesy calls with the President of Trinidad and Tobago, Christine Kangaloo, and Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley. The highlight of his visit was his address at the Emancipation Village of the Queen's Park, Savannah, where he called on the descendants of Africans all over the world to unite in the face of rising violence and the global scourge of drugs. On his final day, the Asante Haney toured at the University of Trinidad and Tobago's Point Lisa's campus. And during the tour, Education Minister Dr. Nian Gansby-Dolly said talks are still in the infant stage, but there is a possibility for Trinidad and Tobago and Ghana to collaborate in the education sector. Mahalia Joseph Wharton, TDT News.